Hello, Diecast fans, and welcome to another brand new episode of Jim's Magnificent Miniature Motor Cars. Yep, for this episode, we will be unboxing a car from a brand that has only ever been featured one other time on this channel, and that was to showcase a Nissan GTR. Well, I am now unboxing another majorette, this time released under its 60th anniversary banner. Okay, and this is a Renault Maxi Turbo. Without any further ado, let us get on with the unboxing. First, let's have a look at this, this packaging. It's quite lovely. Okay, it's a blister pack, but again, to mark the occasion, Renault has included one of these lovely tins. They've done these before. I have never had the occasion to unbox them here, but I was never quite inclined. But now I finally decided to pull the trigger. Okay. Alrighty. Here's the car. So okay. So first things first things first. Let's have a look at the car. Right, this is not a new casting, to my understanding. This has been around, well, at least as long as, uh, at least as long as the Nissan GTR. I mean, so that that casting is about what three, four years old now, and so that's how old this is. And you know what? It's not. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's about this is uh, this this anniversary edition is about uh, five hundred pesos, four hundred ninety nine pesos. I'll flash the graphics so you see how much that is, and you see why there's a premium. I mean, there are rubber tires here. Of course, later on, there's we'll show the the lovely anniversary packaging. But even just as a, a as a value proposition in and of itself, this car is not bad by any stretch. It's not hard to argue that it deserves the premium treatment. Oh, got it. Oh, that's very nice. That is honestly very nice. I mean, I don't give this brand enough love, to be honest. And well, that's in part because, you know, they, they don't really release that many cars that I like. I'd like, for example, to get my hands on some of their Porsche 911s, but well, I don't seem to find any in this part of the world. The 911 GT3 RS with the rubber tires. And that, that does exist, but for some reason, Major, it haven't seen fit to sell them here in the Philippines. Okay, that, that is, that's really nice. Okay, so as a model, I'm gonna go ahead and rate this with an eight, with an 8.5 out of 10, yeah. Yep, I, I think it's pretty solid. Unless anyone asks me why it's so expensive, well, again, it comes with this and it's an anniversary edition. So I'm gonna go ahead and say, okay, it's justified. Oh, look at that, that's really nice. So you, you open the, the little tin by sliding it, not by popping it open. Sort of like those little, uh, Back in the day, you know, my, my late grandmother used to have these little artificial sweeteners which came in a tin that you open like this. Hermesetas for any of you who remember. But anyway, so that's how you open this and I think it's really nice, it's really cute. So yeah, again, uh, 8.5 for the Renault 5 Turbo. Okay, and that's it for this unboxing. I hope you folks enjoyed this episode. If you like what you see, please consider giving me a like and a subscribe and hitting that notification bell.